So a quick video for those of you who are supporters of my Line 6 Complete Helix Preset Library. Uh, if you're not a supporter yet, it's just $5, and we're up to 46 presets now. I just did a massive update last night. So we've got a lot of stuff in there for humbucker electric guitars, single coil electric guitars. I spent a lot of the time on the ship with this Strat, so I made a lot of new ones for the Strat. Uh, I've got some acoustic guitar stuff in there. I'm working on nylon string stuff right now, once I get strings on that. Um, and I've got a lot of stuff for electric violin and acoustic violin as well. So something in there for everybody. Uh, a lot of new stuff. Uh, if you're already a supporter, you can just search the email in your inbox. Uh, that was from me, the original one. The link in there is still going to be good. So the subject would be download complete Helix library, hyphen my name. And you can follow that Google Drive link and you'll just be able to get all the new presets that I've made in addition to the updates to the old ones. So on this ship, I was playing with a, a, an eight-piece band every night. So I was dialing in a lot of these presets in the context of a full band using my in-ears. Um, basically, how I would do it was I was sitting in my cabin with headphones on, making the initial adjustments to the presets. Then I would go to an isolated room with a JBL FR FR speaker. And I was just playing that back, making some more fine adjustments. I would use them over the course of a couple nights in the theater in the context of that band just to see how everything you know sat in there and how it mixed together and if it was present enough that you could hear it, if it would cut through. And then finally near the end of the contract before I left, I actually sat behind the front of house desk um, where all the speakers in this theater are pointing right at you and I dialed them in just to you know get an idea of what it sounds like coming through the actual mains in the house. Uh, so I think these presets are very finely tuned now. A lot of them, they're mostly just amp sims with some compression and extra overdrive options adding it, added in there. Uh, what I use the Helix for, the HX Stomp, mostly is just a amp sim platform. So I'll use this for my amp tones and my overdrives, compression, and stuff like that. And I'll combine it with external reverb and delay. There are some presets that are full package stuff. So if you were using the Helix or the HX Stomp as your entire rig. Uh, there are some presets in there for that, but mostly this is just very finely tuned amp tones, for me anyway, and that's what the preset library is based on. I get a lot of emails from people asking, can I use this with Helix LT and the Helix Floor or the Rack version? Yes. Uh, take the presets and build them into your own. Put your own effects on it. The effects are pretty easy to dial in. So if you want to use the amp tones that I've come up with and kind of build your own presets around that, I know a lot of people do that. So in short, my Helix library now has a ton of new sounds in it and a lot of updates to the old sounds you might already be using. I just have two questions for you. Number one, if you're using the preset library, which is your go-to sound uh, from mine? Which one do you like the best? And number two, if you could have one thing that I would create to put in that preset library, what would it be? What would you like to see in the future there? So thanks for watching. As always, stay tuned to this channel for more Helix videos. Check out the free Helix preset playlist I've got in the description of this video. And if you're watching in the future, check out my website as well. I'm going to have a ton of Helix patches on the website once I get that up and running. Thank you all for your support and thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.